Hey y'all, I am back. I am back. Damn right, I'm coming from the galaxy. Got on my mind over matter shirt. If y'all can see it. Mind over matter. Yeah. No, I hang around the big hitters. Well, the big hitters, we hang around each other. You no, know, I came because I wanted to come. But those three deaths in uh, Mexico, <clears throat> they said it was carbon monoxide poisoning. Who knows what it could be. But I know one thing, they gone out of this avatar. Out of this room, I don't know. But the avatar is no longer in use. I said, let me use the world. What that look like, Saturn? A knockoff Saturn, because Saturn rings are not like that. <clears throat> it's amazing how they go for their planet, though. Saturn rings, Saturn. That's Saturn. I just realized that. Storm is coming in Florida. Get ready. Election time. Chicken sandwich time. That uh, chicken sandwich release date come out, I think it was 11 9, 2022. You turn 11 9 around, you get 911. 911 in Jamatra is sacrifice. Booyah! So you sacrificing something by eating that damn chicken sandwich. That's what I'm saying. Want to eat it? That's on you. You got to deal with it. I never ate that chicken sandwich a day in my life. I don't know how it tastes and I don't care to know. Like I told people, you want to make you a chicken sandwich? Go get you a whole chicken. How about that? At least you would know it's a chicken. Get you a whole chicken. And when you get that whole chicken filet, you want to eat you a chicken sandwich. I can't tell nobody what to eat. And make sure it's organic. Don't be around here trying to say bigger is better. Because in that case, no, it's not. I be damn. I'm being honest. No, it's not. I'm supposed to be getting some soil this week and some parts. I already got, uh, I had already did some green onions and stuff. I, I know how to grow stuff. That's what it's going to be. You're going to have to start making your own bread. Why well, go buy a loaf of bread when you could make your own, get you some loaf pain. Get your low pants and make your own bread. That's the way it's going to have to be. See, when we come back self-independent in that field, because that's where they got the strong cold at, you'll see change. And we'll never be able to eat like how our grandparents ate. You know why? You know why? Well, some of our grandparents, because from what I heard, my family ain't eat all them chitlins and stuff. But to each his own. When they had they, they animals, even the buffaloes, they knew who the mama buffalo is. They knew who the daddy. They knew their family. It, like how we know each other, they knew the animals. Now you don't know who you eat. Real talk, that's why I said it'd be a sensible thing. Like a whole chicken. <clears throat> now... You see that whole chicken, you know it ain't no rat. Hopeful, but not well. I don't know. I'm going to just leave that alone, but you're going to eat what you're going to eat. That's why I have to laugh. And don't hide it. Be who you are. Because everybody going to eat what they going to eat. Everybody ain't no damn Dr. Sabi. And they shouldn't be. 
you got people that didn't live Dr. Sabi ways. They lived they they lived their ancestor ways and they are scribing. Real talk. So whatever fits your boat, whatever rocks your boat. Don't rock it too hard because you might you might not be able to float. Cause you know boats float. Float on top of that water. If they didn't, they'll sink. Three Americans died, and they from Louisiana. Louisiana is the capital of voodoo. I don't know why everybody think it's New Orleans. New Orleans ain't the capital. New Orleans is not the capital. And I got that through meditation. Real talk. That's why it's good to just meditate. I got that doing meditation. Show sure did when I was talking about Boosie the Token Collector. Because I never knew about that shit. But then when I got it, I went and researched it. And true enough, it's the capital. Louisiana is the capital city of uh, Creole. I think they call it Creole. Uh, Yeah. And all them from <clears throat> make you wonder. And then they went there on the day of the day. I think day of the day they went. They died. They died on the day of the day. And it was intelligent people. They had futures. Everybody got a future. But what I'm saying, y'all know how some people had their shit set. They had their life all figured out. They was teachers. Carbon monoxide. I remember when a story similar to that happened. And I'm going to look that story up. When five people went to uh, Okeechobee Road in Hialeah, Florida for a boy birthday party. They were Haitians, too. They were from Little Haiti. This happened some years ago, but I never forget because it made me cry because it was sad, man. They went and they went to the, the hotel I had went to. The hotel got a garage. I forgot the name of that hotel. It got a garage. And in the garage, you put your cop under, and it's a two story. And upstairs in the hotel, you got the uh, the heart shaped jacuzzi. It's nice. It's nice. Them, them Cubans know how to do it, boy. But uh, anyhow, they didn't want to cut their car. And they left the car running. From what I read, they left it running on his birthday. They went to get some McDonald's, and the car was acting up. And they went and cut the car off, and they left it running. And I think about five or six people died in that room. I ain't bullshitting. I'm going to see if I can find that article. And they were Creole, too. French. It was a horrible story. I was like, damn. I couldn't believe it. All of them. I was like, damn, man. Why nobody couldn't tell them? Y'all cut the car off. Get a jump. Don't leave no car running in an enclosed area. Because the carbon monoxide is, is, is a gas that is, uh, you can't smell it. That weed went in my mouth. But anyhow, they went in there. They, they didn't party for long. They said a housekeeper found them. I can imagine how she felt when she went in there and saw all them dead men. I think it was like five or six of them. In this case, it was three. And... I'm not picking, but to each his own. Nobody don't really know how they, they, they assuming that it was carbon monoxide. Who knows? But I, I read somebody page and that's why I say I, I ain't really trusting these people and no offense. I ain't going to say this person's name, but just know this person ain't my friend on Instagram. Nor are they my friend, or do they follow me, or do, and I think I'm going to unfollow that person. Nor do I could really feel a, you know, I'm going to be honest. I 
I could feel the true person, like the intention. I'm not saying this person not the real deal, but what I'm saying is I feel a little phoniness, like. And people build phony people up. It's sad and true. And the real ones sit in the back with all their classics. And then they don't took the work from the real ones. And I've seen it. I've seen it. But what I'm finna say, and I'm here to believe. I'm going to just say it. Because I keep it real on my channel. A lot of people say things that they are and they're not. I'm not telling the person what to say. But this person consider themselves one of the highest <clears throat> white practitioners of being a witch. I don't message this person, man. This person we never talk. We we never. Is they to be honest? They contacted me. <laughs> they contacted me. I have a grand master on my page. Shout out to Mr. Michael Gibson. They see the light. He see the light. He's a ascended master. Go check his work out. He's he, him and his wife. Real talk. But anyhow, back to the faker. I, I'm gonna be honest. Some people, I ain't gonna say shit, but. Uh, how could I say it? How you say you work with with magic? And everybody do. But you know the arts of magic and you telling somebody to rest in peace. Get the hell out of here. Where they do that at? Y'all haven't even, they haven't even figured out how these people transcend it. And you telling they soul, spirits, energy to rest. A true witch, no. Ain't no damn resting. It's impossible. How? How? I thought that rest in peace shit was over. Even, let me shut up. Nope, let me keep talking. Somebody got to say it. I'm that one to say what people really want to say, and they just probably don't want to hurt nobody's feelings. Y'all know how I feel about it. Self-explanatory. I don't care about your feelings. Your feelings will get people in trouble. You around here talking about no. See, when you working with feelings, you don't lose every time. Logics work better than feelings. I feel this is the right answer, and you be dead wrong. But when you use logics and you add things up, cause numbers don't lie, then you get your you get, you get your question, you get your answer to your question. Boy, when I I ain't gonna budge you. When I heard, I said, okay, let me listen to it, cause it came on on my, uh. Damn, this person, I got to make sure, because I think this person followed me. I don't, it ain't even about who followed who, but I'm going to say this to get my point across. I'm very skeptical about a page that come to my page that have a lot of followers. Don't ask me why, because I just feel that way. I'm not a person that get rowdy when I see somebody contact my page and they got 20,000 followers. It don't faze me at all because they just who I am, even if they is a, a reptilian. It don't matter. They don't matter what planet or whatever the dimension you're from. Matter can't get outside of space. You ain't outside this damn universe. You right in it with me. So it don't matter. But I be worried, you know what I'm saying? Because when that person contacted me, they had like over 10,000 followers. I'm like, damn. But I remember this person from Facebook back in the days. But I never followed them. This is real. So I gave that person, but when I heard that rest in peace, and you don't even... No matter what you say, I ain't telling you what to say, but we both know energy can't rest. That's what, that's what tilted my thought. I'm like, in which you can say what you want to say, but you around here calling yourself a practitioner of magic, it, and that don't sit right with me. 
If you're a practitioner, imagine we both know that you ain't making shit rest. You in that field. I ain't talking about nobody else who so-called conscious, aware, and all that. No, I'm talking about that person. Because you dealing with energies. <sighs> Y'all dealing with some fake people out here. Keep them cash apps rolling. Don't catch me and put nothing on here. You do, you do. Okay? I made that promise to myself and I'm going to stick with it. I don't give a damn how big my channel get. <clears throat> no offense to the people that do ask because that's, that's what they want to do. And I don't blame them. But for, for me, I made a promise. And I can't break that promise. I made the promise before I even started getting on the internet. The promise was made without the internet. Same way I promised my cousin. I won't look at you if they don't fulfill your wishes. They didn't. And guess who didn't look at it? I kept my word. Not asking, no. But now if I put my link, that's different. See how that sound? You could still do it, but hey. They found for they killed the legend. They were found found three of them. Two men and one lady. And she talking about rest in peace. I don't even expect you to say rise infinitely high to be honest. But damn, rest in peace? Some say rise high in heaven. That sound better than rest in peace. And I'm glad it's catching on because I read somebody comment. And they were like, why you want to tell that man the killer ain't been called rest in That's right. Rest, rest. It ain't even about the, the avenge or the murder, but it's about the energy. We both know. Damn it. Energy. They said energy can't be created nor destroyed. So why in the hell is this person who say they are a big practitioner, got all these followers, telling this energy to rest, these three energies to rest in peace? I can't listen to you after you say that. Because we both, well, she may not. <sighs> when I heard that, I scrolled back. And I really believe this person, they did. And I was skeptical because I'm like, I just feel this phoniness. I could feel you. And you phony. Somebody got to tell it. But I think soon the phoniness of people will, they're, they're self-exposed they self. I call them like MF Doom, rap snitches, telling all your business, sit in the court and be your own star witness. Do you see the perpetrator? Yeah, I'm sitting right here, messing around, get the whole crew set up for years. <laughs> MF Doom, I love that man music. Shout out to MF Doom, rise infinitely high, king. I like all his music. I like Capital uh, Steve's. I like that Chicago. He kind of remind me of a, a Kanye West. Very intelligent. They said allegedly he jumped off the building. Capital. All this stuff. Like I said, I believe Takeoff was an ascended master. I got my reasons. I ain't got to explain it. I really believe because it's just too many coincidences. And I went over the story with somebody and they, they ain't got to believe, but I felt like they were like, damn. Going to tell somebody, rest in peace. You know better than that. You say you work with energies. Rise infinitely high. That's my terminology. Because... I'm going to be honest. I don't hear nobody saying it. I hear people say rise in 
heaven. A rest in heaven. They don't even say rise in heaven. They say a uh, rest in heaven. You ain't resting no energy. Maybe that's why I could never get the R.I.P. on me. Telling something to rest. That ain't for me to, to do. Even if I cut off my light switch, the electricity still running through the wires. Even if the light company cut off the light. Or the light shut down. Because that ain't going to happen. I pay my bills. But anyhow, the light company cut off the light, right? The electricity still running. All you got to do is go pay the bill. Just because you don't, you don't see electricity, but you, you see the benefit. You see the, the outcome of Rest in peace. No resting. I need to go read the comments. I was flabbergasted when I read that part of the post. I wouldn't even ask you for your advice concerning death. Because, you know, D-E-A-T-H uh, doesn't really mean that. It sure doesn't. Can you prove it? Here it is. And I paper as you do. Let me write the word right quick and I'm gonna dip. D E A T H. Now. You remove that D, what you get in that in that H. You got death. D E A T H. But you remove the D and you remove the H. What you got? Eat. Is there anything else I would like to say? <laughs> Man, y'all some fake ones out here and I'm seeing y'all. Am I going to stop calling out your names? Maybe if I get permission from the ancestors. But I'm not here to bash nobody. But I'm here to alert people. Some fake ones out here. Fake it till you make it. But you faking it, you ain't going to never make it. I'm out. Peace.